Contemporary art is making history. I'm here at the Guggenheim where we're exploring the latest commission for Chinese art. The Guggenheim has been exploring the world through art since 1937. The latest spot on its agenda? China. The museum has been gifted a $10 million grant by the Robert H. N. Ho Family Foundation. This donation will allow the Guggenheim to commission works from contemporary artists born in Taiwan, Hong Kong, and Macau. Senior curator Alexandra Monroe explains the impact this grant will have on the Guggenheim and the international art world. This is a quantum leap in terms of our collaboration. It's a quantum leap for the research and study and presentation of contemporary Chinese art in this country. And it's a quantum leap for the larger project of what is contemporary Chinese art today in a global context. The grant also provides the museum the opportunity to sponsor a Chinese contemporary art curator. This is the first curatorial position in history to be dedicated to contemporary Chinese art created in an American museum. The curator will work with the Guggenheim as they choose from at least three of the commissioned artists to enter the Guggenheim's permanent collection. It, it automatically places the work from China in a different kind of light through a different lens than you would see if it were a, f a, a, a context that was strictly Chinese. While there are a few firsts for the Guggenheim in this project, working with the whole family is not one of them. This project marks the third Guggenheim and Robert H. N. Ho Family Foundation partnership. The foundation was the lead sponsor of two of the Guggenheim's award-winning exhibits, the Tai Go Zhao exhibit in 2008 and the Third Mind exhibit in 2009. The Guggenheim hopes the successful past will mirror a bright future in the education of Chinese art. We also hope to be surprised. We hope that the project over the next five years will teach us things about China, that the artists will, will enlighten us about developments in China that we haven't perhaps even foreseen yet. The three exhibitions will be available for viewing from 2014 through 2017, indicating the promising future for Chinese contemporary art in a global context. Reporting for Sign Edition Journal, I'm Christy Clements.